Hi, um, today I'm going to be doing an introduction video for you for uh, my world geography, uh, geography class. I can't say that word. Um, for Miss Wallace. So, um, basically this video, I need to kind of introduce myself. And, um, I, when I heard uh, I had to do a video, I, I know it sounds cringy, but I kind of got psyched. So, um, yeah, let's get into this. But, uh, also I think I should say, um, I'm going to use my personal computer because, uh, my phone for a microphone stinks, and I just hate using the, the Chromebook, like, really badly, so, um, yeah, N now let's get started. What would you like to be called, and what's your last name? So, um, my name is Joshua Gardner, but, um, people always ask me Josh or Joshua. I don't really care, but if I had to choose one, it would probably be Joshua. Who are you? What defines you? Describe yourself, and what makes you happy? Uh, that's kind of a hard question to, like, answer. Uh, who am I? That, that's way too complicated, but, uh, defining myself, I can definitely say that I'm a determined person. Uh, if you give me something, I will try my best to get it done, no matter what the cost. Um, but also describing myself, uh, I'm kind of like an omnivert, where like I'll be outgoing sometimes, and sometimes I probably would just want to stay in my chair all quiet. So, um, but what makes me happy is definitely um, making videos, hanging out with friends, uh, playing games, and this kind of sounds cheesy, but going on adventures, you know, just um, doing things, exploring. I definitely like traveling. So, um, yeah. But but no, videos are like definitely on the top. <laughs> Why do you think geography is a required class? I think that's the simplest question I can answer here. It's about the world that we live in. I, I think that's simple enough. Since we live in it, I think we should know about the world that we live in. I mean, I, I think it's pretty obvious, but... What helps you learn? What do you like seeing in the classroom? Um, I definitely like how you said uh, basically how... You don't want people getting um, comments when, like, the answer uh, or ask a question, and they're almost made fun of for it. Because uh, that's definitely happened a lot in classes when I, I kind of feel bad. I it's happened to me before, um, and just just hearing you say that definitely is like a one up, no, a, like a plus five in my book. But um, what also helps it work, which is going to sound kind of weird, but uh, when people kind of review things, but not in just one section. Because, like, what teachers normally do is they'll get everything down, and then they'll just have one day where you're supposed to cram everything down in one whole review, which I, I can't do. Most people can't do it. And you can, but you're just kind of regurgitating and just looking through your notes. You're not actually learning. So, um, if you could, like, maybe slide in a little bit of a review, um, asking a question once in a while, I think that would definitely help me and a few others um, memorize things a lot better. Uh, what don't you like in the classroom? Everything. <laughs> uh, what did you like in the classroom? What hurts your learning? This is going to be kind of like bland, but I don't really care what happens in the classroom as long as I can learn. If something is distracting me or keeping me from learning what I need to do for the day, then that's the only time I really have a problem. I, I, I don't care if someone's screaming around behind me, um, you know, messing around and wants to get themselves in trouble, but if it starts affecting me, then then I not gonna have that. There's also teaching, but I already went over that. <laughs> Six, do you have any ideas for what you want to do after high school? Definitely, I have a lot of ideas. Um, don't know any colleges I want to go to yet, but uh, I definitely want to get into the entertainment industry of um, like acting and uh, maybe being a director of photography. Um, but I also want to do videos. Um, I I've been trying to do YouTube for a while. I, I love doing YouTube. Um, it's I just love how people can um, express themselves other than getting to uh, other things where you almost are judged all the time. Even if your content does stink, there's some kind of... something you can take away from it, which I really enjoy. Oh yeah, and after uh, high school, I want to take like a, a little bit of a break so I can go on like a traveling trip. So uh, this is also why I like this class, so I can maybe learn about where I want to go. <laughs> Seven, if you could do one thing to change the world, what would it be and why? This is probably the hardest question that I, I actually get asked a lot. Uh, and this can be, like, I definitely have different opinions, but if I had to put into one word without going to an entire rant, it would definitely be opportunity. I believe that, yes, some people already had enough opportunities, but I think every single person should have a chance. Even if they do mess up once, give them another chance. At least let them prove themselves before actually judging them, because if you don't let them do that, then you're just as bad as them. So I, I definitely think opportunity is almost number one. The, there's a lot of other things I could say, but that is definitely the top of the list. Although uh, that's kind of like impossible since, you know, the world isn't fair, but that's, that's what I said. <laughs>
so uh, sorry I didn't want to go in too much into detail. I don't want to make this video like way too long. I feel like everyone else is going to make it like three minutes long. So uh, thank you for re uh, looking over this uh, introduction. And um, I hope we have a great year. <laughs> Bye.